It's me, it's me, it's me. It's Nick. With a new video, it's Nick. Come check me, it's Nick. What's up, y'all? What's up, y'all? This your girl, Nick, coming with um, a quick little try on haul video. I've gotten um, a few pieces from She Inside, along with some shoes from She Inside and um, some shoes from Nordstrom and maybe a shirt from Amazon, a t shirt. But um, let's get started with this haul. Um, I'm wearing the first two pieces from She In right now. I got this t shirt. I love these little Sailor V's t-shirts. I think this shirt is a 2X. It's like a soft pink color. The lighting here isn't that great, so I know you can't see the true color of it. This shirt is, like I said, a 2X. Really good cotton material. Stretches a little bit. Um, I also got these shorts from Shein. It's like pop art or whatever. Look like newspaper print. Little like dolphin shorts, they call them. I got these in the 3X because I wasn't sure how small they would be cut. But I guess these would be cool for, you know, lounging around the house or something. Might even be wearing them outside a few times to like roller skate in or something like that. Um, they fit. They seem to fit great. The material is almost like, um, it feels almost like basketball shorts a little bit. Um, but I don't see like the little perforated holes in them that you usually see in basketball shorts. And plus, they aren't as silky, I would say, as the basketball shorts are. But uh, that's this. Okay. Now I'll be right back with the next thing. Okay, so next we have this little roller skate tee from Amazon. This is cotton, and it's straight cotton. No stretch in it. Um, I'm thinking I might need to size up. I'm not sure. And this, uh, it's just a lady with an afro roller skating. Ordered it to wear to my grandmother's uh, skate party that we're giving her in a few weeks. And again, I ordered this off of Amazon. This is how it looks. I mean, it fits just right, but I'm worried that once I wear it and wash it, it's going to be too snug. So maybe I might size up to the next size. I don't know. What you guys think? Okay, I'm back. This time with a swimsuit. This is a size 2X. I bought this while it was on sale. This is my first swimsuit I've ever ordered off of Shein. You know, their swimsuits uh, are uh, final sale. So I'm glad that this fits. I like this high waist. It kind of makes my legs look great. Um, I'm not going to show you the whole thing because I have that right here. So I don't want that to show. But yeah, that's this swimsuit. Um, this will have to be like a swimsuit that I wear on vacation while I'm chilling by like the adult pool or something like this. I like this because this kind of like camouflages all the boobs a little. But this under here, if I do too much, boob is going to fall out, see? So, I don't want that to happen. But I think this is cool. I will definitely use it on vacation this summer. Again, this is a 2X and this is from She Inside. I'll be right back with, I think I have another swimsuit to show you guys, and then on to the shoes. Be right back. Okay, guys, I'm back with the second swimsuit. This is a one-piece that has cut out here in the front. Ties here. Well, this is just a piece that ties around, a small little loop that ties around. This whole swimsuit. Ruffles on the sleeves. Again, I bought these swimsuits while they were on a very big sale. 
So I didn't pay full price for them. And then there was like another coupon on top of the sale price. So I said, let me just grab two while they're on sale to try out this one too. I like this. I like this kind of look because it, I mean, for plus size women, it, bro it draws attention up here and not down here too if you have, you know, a, st a tummy like myself. I just need to get like some cute cover up to go with this. But I like it. Um, that little padding that comes inside, you gotta adjust it to fit your boob because it's not adjusted right now. The padding thing is sitting right here. I hate it. I might end up taking it out altogether. But that's this swimsuit. I forget how much it was, but if there's um, still a picture of it on the website, I'll definitely add that into the video so that you guys can see exactly what it was that I ordered. Yeah, I like this. I like this a lot. I'm going to be at somebody's resort pool chilling with this one. Yeah. Okay. Now, I'll be right back with, I think all I have left is um, some shoes to show you guys that I ordered. Be right back. Okay guys, so I'm back with the first pair of shoes. Um, these are rose gold, rose gold platform shoe by Jeffrey Campbell that I ordered from Nordstrom.com. It has a flower at the top. Don't ask me this, um, the heel height and all that stuff because I don't know offhand. Um, they seem to be cut pretty true to size. I first, I think I saw um, a performance that Jasmine Sullivan did with a dress on, and I think she had these on or something very similar. And I I saw her in the video, and I was like, oh, those shoes are so cute. You know, I wish I could find something similar to that. And then about a week and a half later, I was just browsing platform shoes on Nordstrom's website and came across these and ordered them immediately. And it was a good thing I did because they were, they sold out of these super fast. They came in this rose gold, um, a metallic multicolor version with like orange and stuff like that, which I also ordered. And they came in like a mint and silver color as well. And that mint and silver color. I think everything is sold out except for a size six. But um, I got these. Um, with intentions on trying to find something to wear with them to a destination wedding that I'll be attending later this year. Um, this rose gold pair, um, I decided that if I don't find something I really, really like to wear with this, then I'm probably going to wear these to um, um, somebody's 60th birthday party later this, um, later this uh, summer. But these are by Jeffrey Campbell, and then I'm going to step back so you can see how they look on my foot. Again, I ordered them in two um, colorways, and so I have one rose gold one on my foot and the one multicolor one. really really like them they're super easy for me to walk in their stands in they aren't hurting or anything like that and it's just excuse me for that creaking on the floor walking on that plastic but yeah they are they're just my flavor I really really like them and I do believe they that this pair is the pair Jasmine Sullivan was wearing in this performance um, that I saw on YouTube it, at least it looks like it. Maybe she has a more expensive version of the same shoe on. But, yeah. These are Jeffrey Campbell's. Um, I'll be right back. I have one more pair of Jeffrey Campbell's in a different style to uh, show you. 
And then I have three pairs of sandals from Shein. So it's the same shoe, different colors. Um, that I wanted to try out, like that square toe look that everybody's getting. So I'll be right back with the next sandal. Wow, thought I was recorded and done in the video cut. I mean, the camera cut off in the middle of me talking. I wasn't recording. I just had the camera um up. But anyway, so here's the third shoe. Well, really, it's the second design because the first two pairs I showed you were the same, but two different colors. So this one also came from Nordstrom. It's also a Jeffrey Campbell platform. Um, Again, I'm ordering stuff. Um, in anticipation for this wedding that I'm going to and trying to figure out what I want to wear. I, will, I usually start my outfit search by getting a cute pair of shoes and then finding something to coordinate with those. Uh, this shoe is new to the Nordstrom site, but after a search on Instagram, I see that these were out last year. Um, this is by Jeffrey Campbell. I think it's called Disco. Um, it's spelled like disc D I S Q U E dash O platform. This one's a little bit different from the other one, of course. It has not designed at the front. Um, the colors are a little bit different. This is a more red than orange that is on that other platform. Then you have the blue here and the green on here. Really, really cute shoes. Um, again, this is my style because the heel is thick and it's not that much dip here in the arch which makes it easy for me to walk in. Um, I think these were um, $145 on Nordstrom's. The other shoe, I think, was $160. But um, this shoe, it said that you needed to size up. These were supposed to be cut a half size too small, so I sized up to an 8. My foot's a little fat. Um, when I, um, My initial try on, I noticed that my foot comes to the front a little bit, and I feel like if I tried to go back and size down to the seven and a half, which is my regular size, I think my foot might hang off the back just a tad. So I'll stick with this eight and just put the uh, the insert here to keep my foot from sliding to the front. Um, but that's enough specs. I don't know what the heel height, the platform height or anything. You'd have to go to Nordstrom and look it up for yourself. But I thought they were super, super cute and colorful. <sighs> My goal is to find a really pretty dress that has a v-neck or that, I think they call it surplus where it looks like it's a wrap dress or something like that here. And it's like fitting on the boobs. So you can see this part here small and then flare out. That's what I want. Um, and right now I kind of want something that's a little bit above the knee and just flow out. That's the type of dress I'm looking for. So if you guys see something, put it down in the comments so I can go ahead and check it out. But, uh, yeah, this is Disco by Jeffrey Campbell. I'm going to slip it on so that you can see how it fits my foot. I'm not buckling it either. All right, so let me step back so you guys can see. What do you guys think of these? Hmm? Put it down in the comments. I'll be right back with the last three pair. Again, they're all from Shein side. It's all the same shoe, different colors. I think one of them I might have sized up um, just to see if there was a big difference in a seven and a half and an eight. So I'll be right back with you guys with those shoes. Okay, the last three shoes. These are all from she inside. Square toe thong. Um some of the reviews said they were cut big, some said they were tree size. So this white pair and the yellow pair, I got them both in a seven and a half. And then I got the coral pink one in a seven. And I'll show you in a second how they both uh fit me. 
um, I don't need to try this white one on because it's the same as the other two pair. But this is how it looks. Super long, but I feel like it might look cuter. Let's see. I'll be right back. Okay, so this is how they look on. This yellow one is a seven and a half. This pink one is a seven. They definitely need like a uh, like a a pair in, on under the ball of your feet because you can tell that they were make the ball of your feet dirty. But this skin here was cool because it's not as high and it's not like a high arch or different issue from the heel to the ball of the feet. But they're super cute. They're very, very comfortable right now. I like to try some. I don't know, I think I'm going to make the sage curl ones back and get the seven and a half. Because they fit just right and my foot is pushing up um, on that thong part in between my toes. So, but that's this. And that concludes this whole video. If you like anything that you saw here, remember I'll put in a picture with possibly the name of each item so that you can search for it yourself on the websites that I got them from. Let me know in the comments what you guys think of everything here. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to the channel. Peace. Peace out, y'all. Remember to be cool, be kind, and to show love to one another. Have a blessed one.